Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, travel, home decor, and even the occasional dash of Disney. So if you enjoy unboxings, I do hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. That way you'll find out whenever I post new videos, which is usually at least once a day, if not twice, whenever I announce giveaways. We do have a giveaway that is wrapping up in the next couple of days, so make sure you've watched all of the videos between October 14th and October 20th fifth to get all of the secret passwords to win a mystery box or two or three or however many I decide to put together. I will give you a hint. There are a total of five passwords. So you have the opportunity to enter five times into that giveaway. And of course, you want to turn that notification bell on so that you find out whenever I go live. It is usually on the eighth of every month, but sometimes that changes. So you want to get the notifications for the community tab updates. As always, if you are already subscribed, thank you so much for being here and welcome back. Today, I I have a beautiful bi-monthly lifestyle box that I have had the pleasure of opening several times here on the channel and that is the Wildflower Club. This has been sent to me for review. The Wildflower Club is $49.95 every other month plus $9.95 in shipping but if you use the code Noelle you can save $5 on your first box. She often has a wait list because this box does sell out right now. I think there are a couple slots available for the December box but you want to hurry up and get that. I just I just think she does such a lovely job with the curation. She has a lot of her own artwork in the box and it's just perfect for the woman who loves the outdoors, who's kind of got that wild and free wildflower spirit, but without being sort of a camping tactical gear subscription box, right? So it's still got beautiful items, things that you can enjoy, enjoy in the great outdoors as well as in the comfort of your own home. And I've really enjoyed it over the past probably like year now, maybe. So let's go ahead and get Get into it and see what we have got. So inside there is always a quote usually from John Muir. It says, keep close to nature's heart and break clear away once in a while and climb a mountain or spend a week in the woods. Wash your spirit clean. And then we have this beautiful tissue paper here right on top. So I'm just going to remove this really pretty gold bee tissue paper. So lovely. And uh, see if what we've got in terms of our card. So there is always like a lovely little letter from Katie who puts this box together. It says, one year ago, I started the Wildflower Club. See, there you go. It says, we've included a special extra treat in your box to celebrate our first birthday. It's been a wonderful year and I've enjoyed every box I put together for you. But this honey themed box might just be my favorite one yet. I love when boxes do honey or bee themes and it does happen quite a bit, you guys, because it is such a great theme. It says, everything in your box is made by a variety of small businesses that are either women owned, eco-friendly, social conscious small batch or all of the above thank you for supporting small businesses love doing that and then we have this nice long list of all of the items in here and it looks like we have got quite a few and they kind of range in size you know we'll get some beautiful um, stickers we'll get some like gorgeous hand lettered prints and I'm guessing that there'll be some of that stuff in here so hopefully we can go over that at the end but already you guys I am seeing the beautiful like color theme all of that like golden honey kind of goes with my sunflowers here in the background so let's get started first thing I see right on top is from your green kitchen it is a reusable produce bag it's it's the medium small size and I love this because it's not a mesh one it's just this super duper soft cotton you guys with this beautiful bee printed on it I love that and then it just has this nice little drawstring at the top so let me see if I can find this on here yes reuse reusable produce bag from your green kitchen and they're Canadian company so love that it's super duper soft I feel like you could use this for traveling as well like to put your unmentionables in or um, if you have really small feet it could be a shoe bag I have really big feet, so it's probably not gonna work, but it could definitely be a good uh, travel um, bag as well to or organize things. And you guys know that I love getting an edible treat. And I also love when it's popcorn. So this is from Cornucopia Popcorn. Okay, so this is probably the extra item for their birthday celebration because it is birthday cake is the flavor. So it says vanilla popcorn with white chocolate and party sprinkles, fun. Uh, so it does say that it's handcrafted in Austin, Texas. Let's see how many serving sizes are in this little bag. It says two servings for bag. Okay, that's probably about right because when it's sweet popcorn, I can't like just throw it all in my face like I do with regular salty popcorn. And in one serving there are 293 calories we'll just put that off to the side I'm sure that's still better than actually having a giant slice of birthday cake so <laughs> let's uh, move that off to the side all right so we do have I'm gonna guess that we have honey in here because I got like the little tiny honey wand I love these I have a couple of them um, but they're super duper cute so let me just put that off to the side 
until we see if anything goes with it. Speaking of which, oh, th here we go. So we have, let me just pull some of the shred out because it's kind of got, gotten into our little box. So this is Whipped Honey Mini Sampler by True Bee. So let me see if I can spin them around so you guys can actually see it. Oh, so cool. So Whipped Honey, you guys. So you can kind of see it's got a, like a different color to it. How neat. So we have, um, I'm not going to open it quite yet because I want to uh, preserve the look of it for over on Instagram and I would have to slice this band open. But we have Tennessee Snow Original. It says whipped or creamed. Honey is pure honey that's been whipped or to a spreadable texture. There's a lavender. Oh, so that we have the original whipped honey. Then we have lavender. Whipped honey with lavender extract adds a floral note, creates an interest on a cheese board. Hmm. I do like um, edible lavender. And then cinnamon, organic cinnamon, warms the sweet honey taste and livens up coffee or peanut butter sandwiches. That is a freaking awesome idea. I have had some cinnamon honey from another subscription box, but I've never had whipped honey. I'm super intrigued by that. So maybe I will actually open it up because I just want to see what it looks like. I feel like it may have separated a little bit, so I'm not sure if I can re-whip it or if I can just use that little wand to kind of like froth it up a little bit. So here we go. Let me go ahead and open it up. I'm just trying not to ruin the box. So each of them looks like this little bottle. So it just, cause it was upside down. So this is just, it's not like um, discolored. It's just, there's the honey's all at the top in the lid. So I'm really excited about this more spreadable honey. Huh? So this is a, uh, like, I can't, I don't know which one this is. I think this is just the uh, Eaglesville, Tennessee, True Bee Honey. I think that's that one. And then I'm hoping that it tells me which one is like lavender and which one is not. So I'll have to figure it out because it just like says it here, but I've not seen where on each jar it says which one is which. I'll have to figure it out. Huh. If you guys know, I'm, I'm maybe I'm missing something, but we did get three of them. I just don't know which one is which, but I like the idea that we got a little sampler. Oh, so there is a card and I just like put them out of order. <laughs> Hopefully I can figure it out and figure out which order I put them in. <laughs> All right. So I will figure it out eventually and I guess I'll have to do a taste test and then I'll definitely know. All right. We have something in here that's kind of heftier. So let me go ahead and pull the shred off of this. I don't know if this is like a bag or an apron or what are your guesses, you guys? It's a bag. So this is, uh, where is this from? Cognitive Surplus. So it is this nice tote. Wow. With these uh, like fun honey designs. Wow. It's got like big bees on there. Those are like almost like scientific drawings as well well as like honeycombs and then um of course it's like honeybees are like one of the only like insects that i'm like cool with you know and then inside it just has like that nice uh bright yellow lining it does have that zipper pocket which we're seeing and again it says the brand name there which is nice so let's see how deep that zipper pocket goes this is the honeybee canvas shoulder tote from cognitive surplus they are out of oregon and again, our honeybee sampler came from True Bee Honey and they are from Tennessee. So a pretty shallow little pocket in there, but enough where you can put like your card case or like your phone or your keys so they don't get lost in the bottom of the tote. I'm really hoping that I didn't like mess up the uh, honey sampler in terms of the order of things. All right, you guys, maybe there's like a cheat sheet for how to figure out which one is which. I think we might've gotten more honey. So it came in this little bag. Oh, what is this? Ooh, strawberry honey lip scrub from Wicked Soaps Company. Cool. And it's like this really lovely like rose color. I think that's neat. So they are out of Michigan. I love how she tells us where the companies are located. And then usually I can find them over on Instagram. Sometimes I have to like hunt a little bit. So um, <laughs> that's okay. Uh, looks like we have something from a wildflower paper company, which is kind of uh, who puts this out. It's Katie's company. So it came in this little like vellum bag and it just says be kind of course with b-e-e -E. love these little stickers this again is a nice little decal and then oh this is cool so we got a honeybee cheese board so of course they did suggest to us that we could use that lavender honey um so it's got like a couple little like pock marks but i feel like that just kind of adds to it plus i'm going to cover it with like fruits and cheeses anyway but look how cute it's got this nice hexagon shape it's by talisman designs and then very very faintly they burned in the honeycomb design and a little bee here kind of some of his little like zoom lines i love that but i also love that they're not super deep you guys because that's one of the things when you get those like wood burn um beautiful work sometimes it's gorgeous but i don't want to actually use it for food because then i feel like the food is going to get stuck in there no matter how good you clean it but these it's almost like you can barely 
barely even feel it so I feel like you're gonna be able to wash it really well which is very nice and of course you guys know I love my charcuterie boards and my platters so this is like a single serving size like this is like my personal plate and then like my spin pin for himself um, but that would be like perfect if you were doing now I have so many fun like small boards that I feel like you could do like a girls night and have everybody pick from like a bigger board and like do their own little plates and then like have like movie viewing or something that would be really fun I could probably do that for my husband too but he just always winds up picking off of my plate anyway um, I think oh oh I love this I'm happy that it didn't get too crushed in here this is a candle but it's shaped like a little beehive with a little bee on it is that not the coolest I totally don't want to burn that though so let me see this is a beeswax votive candle from honey honey company out of Florida Ooh, it smells good I love the smell of like real beeswax candles and then I think our last item is our print from again wildflower paper company so it just matches the um, it matches the sticker this is very sweet it's very like springy in the colors but I love it and of course it goes with the fact that it's from the wildflower club box so very very cute I will definitely take some photos for you guys over on Instagram as I always do but let's just make sure I think we got everything let me know in the comments below what your favorite item was your favorite thing to do with honey as well and if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you all very very soon in my next unboxing